going on guys dizzy Aaron here and we're back playing some more yes yes you guessed it yep we're playing goliath last time we, we did so great at this game that i figured um we should probably do it again because you guys seem to still watch the video which i actually don't know if you guys did or if you guys fucking hated it because i'm recording this literally right after i recorded that last video telling you guys about all the games we're gonna be playing this week and i'm pretty sure you guys already guessed this was the first one so um yeah, I, I'm, I'm just gonna keep uh, talking to you guys about random shit and then uh, playing the game as well. How's that sound? Sound amazing? Sounds amazing to me. Okay, so today guys, I, I was gonna talk to you guys about a little something called um, my vlogging channel. Yes. <laughs> so I don't know how long you guys have all been following me. This was the stupidest fucking idea. Stupidest fucking idea. Uh, let's just drop in into the fire. Yeah, the game told me to fucking build the, the little base underneath the wing. Now I can't do shit. Oh, actually, you can, huh? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I saw. Yeah. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Maybe that is a good thing. I'll look at them being smarter than me. <laughs> Alright, anyways, um, so yeah, so I want to talk to you guys today about my vlogging channel. So, um, if you're new to my channel, you probably may have or may not have heard me talk about it. But, 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 at the beginning of the year, I talked to you guys about starting a vlogging channel. Um, and the vlogging channel is basically just going to be like random shit that I do, um, little adventure stuffs that I do. Like last year, around this exact same time, if you go in my videos <laughs> somewhere up there, uh, if you go click on those and search for vlogs you'll see some of my epic vlogs of amazingness <laughs> like literally i named them epic vlog but basically it was just me going to and i'm waiting for charcoal in case you're fucking wondering um <laughs> but it was basically just me going to las vegas with my girlfriend and checking out just random stuff and i pretty much just took you guys along with it uh, along with me to all that stuff <laughs> so it wasn't anything like super serious it was just fun right um, so I, I decided this year that I was gonna do like a clusterfuck of shit like literally um, I don't know where my head was but I, I took on a bunch of different things um, one of them being that I wanted to compete on July 4th at Venice Beach in the uh, bodybuilding competition and uh, yeah, that didn't work out so well for me. Pretty much I got tied up with all kinds of snuff at the beginning of the year, which kind of messed up my whole schedule as far as as far as far work goes and uh, the YouTubes and all that stuff. Cause you may have seen like for a period of time, I was putting up like three or four videos a day. Like lit, how fucking crazy. That's like super pro YouTuber status right there. Um, yeah, don't don't ever do that. It's not a good idea. Um, I was doing I was doing that and I was sticking to my working out. If you follow me on either Twitter or Periscope, yeah, I post like random workout stuff. Uh, I've streamed my workouts before. Over the past, what, six months now? No, yeah, six months. Um, I started cutting down, like on, and when I say cutting down, it just means getting ready for a bodybuilding competition. Um, so losing all my body fat and stuff like that. Um, the whole point of doing the competition wasn't really for any like award or trophy or anything like that. Um, it was more so just for me, just so I could gauge where I'm at and physically, uh, because I've always wanted to compete. Uh, I've always been super scrawny and skinny fat, if you want to call it that, but I've never, I've always wanted to bodybuild and get all crazy with it. All right, let's see what this is. I don't fucking know. <laughs> um, so I, I just basically randomly decided, hey, you know what? I'm going to try this whole bodybuilding thing and see if it works out for me. Um, and then one thing led to another. Motherfucks, I'm trying to tell a story here. I don't know. Yeah, you you hit it with your gun, you little shit. Um, so one thing led to another, and I decided that, hey, you know what? I'm gonna try this whole bodybuilding thing and see if I can actually, like, gain some muscle and some strength, you know? Um, because nobody wants to be, like, the scrawny little kid or whatever. So I started doing that, and, I mean, <laughs> the pictures are pretty bad, ladies and gentlemen, pretty bad. Um, when I started out and then I just started out in my house working out doing shit like uh, what's that thing called? Oh, man, it's some stupid infomercial we have here states blah 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 uh, Hopefully none of you guys were reading that if you did there's a thing called slow motion go back put it in slow motion and just pause <laughs> This will be in 60 FPS or some shit even though it's recording what 48 48 it's still whatever anyways uh the gameplay is not important. <laughs> I'm telling you guys the story. So yeah, so I basically, over the past six months, just been um, getting my diet a lot more strict in order to be able to 
cut down. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. <laughs> In order to be able to compete. Usually, if you're going to compete within 12 weeks from... What? Oh, shit. I should have been reading. Should have been reading. <laughs> All right. Apparently, we killed it. So, that worked. All I do is fucking... Yeah. This game is very, very exciting. Come here, bitch. How do we do this? I don't even know how to... Sh I know we pushed buttons earlier, and I shot shit. Oh, right here. No? Don't you have to... Mother fuck. Yeah, you use that in business. You literally just have to click. Oh, that's so stupid. All right, anyways. <laughs> um, so yeah, usually 12 weeks before a competition is when you get super serious about it and you cut down like all of your sugar, all of your salt, uh, your carbohydrates go down a lot. It's just ridiculous, right? And these past 12 weeks, <laughs> I've been all kinds of busy. So that really messed me up. Now, don't get me wrong, I was still working out, still eating right as if I was gonna compete, cause you never know, maybe I just decided, hey, you know what, I'm just gonna go ahead and compete, cause uh, why the fuck not, <laughs> right? <laughs> cause either way, I, was, I didn't really care if I won or not. Cause either way, I, I didn't really care if I won or not. Like I just wanted a place, right? And I'll get into why I don't even give a shit about that anymore. But before we get to that point, we'll talk about why I didn't uh, start my like whole cutting diet and all that stuff, right? Yeah, so basically I just had too much shit on my plate at one time and I was giving myself even more stuff. Um, and then, and then on top of that, um, I decided to go a different route with my like fitness stuffs. Right now, I did I did pretty good as far as uh, getting myself I, I guess competition ready because there's certain things you can do right before your competition. Oh, oh, what to build structure? Hold left trigger. Ooh, what's it? So we need five logs and some twigs. Alrighty, let's go and uh, we do this. Okay, so I'm getting fucking sidetracked again. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm gonna be editing the gameplay out or myself out in those situations. But yeah, so usually 12 weeks, I think I already said this, <laughs> uh, you're supposed to cut down on, all, on all of your diet. Like you're supposed to get super strict. I didn't do that because uh, like work and stress and all kinds of fun stuff, right? So yeah, I was basically working like 24 hour days <laughs> and some of you guys that that have been following me for a while would know that because I'll literally record these episodes like super late at night if I have to because that's that's my little like, chill out time chill out time so either way videos gonna come out it just depends on when they're gonna come out but that's a whole nother tangent so what was I saying 12 weeks out didn't cut down stress work blah 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 uh yeah and then and then, <laughs> basically, I decided, hey, you know what, motherfuck? Here. Oh, fuck you. Oh, fuck your cow. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Get wrecked. Fucking monkey. Come here. Whatever, cow. Whatever you are. <laughs> All right. There you go. So, what was I saying? Okay. So, as I'm, like, almost ready to, comp to get into competition mode and like start cutting down my diet and all that stuff um i was really close to getting abs which is like what i wanted to do and i'm pretty sure i could have got there um i just recently like as of like last week i went and got all my body fat percentage measured and all that stuff um and i can actually show you guys it's downstairs should i go get it yeah be right back Alright, bam. Um, so yeah, so let's see if I can get that in. What the fuck does it say? Alright, there you go. So under obesity, obesity <laughs> analysis, my uh, BMI or body mass index is 23.5, and my body fat percentage is 8%. So if you look, uh, is that too fucking bright? That probably is. Yeah, you guys can't see shit. <laughs> But take my word for it. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. 
Um, but yeah, so I got down to 8%. Usually competition ready is like four, five percent. It depends on, it really depends on the person on where they store their fat or whatever. Um, but this is coming from somebody that's never competed. So take, don't, don't go too crazy with what I'm saying. My trainer basically has body built and has competed and he's placed in a bunch of shows. So, uh, I think, I think I had some pretty good coaching, but um okay going back to the another reason why i ended up not competing on the bodybuilding competition and decided to go a different route i'm i'm doing power lifting now for those of you guys that don't know what that is it's pretty much just three exercises deadlifts squats and bench press and you you try to get lift the heaviest amount of weight possible in each one of those things for like in my case i i'm trying to break over a thousand pounds using all of, only those three exercises does that make sense? Okay, I don't know if any of that made sense. So we might end up taking that whole thing out of there. But pretty much, I just wanted to be able to measure my progress besides aesthetically. Because like when you look in the mirror and you're like, oh man, look, look at these guns, you know, like after a workout, yeah, you feel good. But if you're doing it to compete, I think um, it, it gets a little bit different. Uh, because you're constantly like looking at your shoulders and you're like, oh man, let's see, is, is this arm bigger than this arm or whatever? But I mean, here. So yeah, it, if I'm sitting there flexing or whatever, then you could see all the like striations or whatever. Yeah, when, I, when we're recording videos, I'm usually just chilling. Uh, but every once in a while, I'll record these type of videos uh, after I go to the gym. So um, I'll be all cracked out. Um, what was I? Oh yeah, <laughs> a power lifted. What it is? What it is? Um, it's the sp I guess, is it a sport? I guess it would be a sport because there's competition and stuff. But pretty much you just try to see how much weight you can lift and you just track your progress. That's it. With one with one lift. Not like a, how many times you can lift it. Just what's the most weight you can lift one time. That's it. I mean, it sounds easy enough, right? Like you're like, oh, okay. Well, that shouldn't be too difficult. All you do is just train and lift. And that's pretty much it. <laughs> but there's a lot of training that goes into it um, and the exercises typically it's just deadlift squats and bench press and that's pretty much it yeah it's just squats deadlifts and uh, bench press and I don't know why I'm collecting I think we got all the what we needed like 10 minutes ago I don't even know how long this video has gone already guys but however long it's gone I'm gonna have to edit out all kinds of shit all right so yeah so I'm gonna be doing some power you know what we might just scrap the whole thing might just scrap the whole thing Hold on. That was not very nice, was it? You're yeah, wrecked, right, son. Okay, so my story, uh, where, where were we with my story? <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, Dizzy's amazing at the story time stuff, huh, guys? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, powerlifting. Okay, so that's 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 where we're going with the whole vlogging thing. I think I'm gonna be tracking my progress um, as far as powerlifting goes, so you guys will be able to tag along and see what my progression's like, um, what my, wh holy shit, what like my max is, cause that's usually what people like anyways, um, that are into fitness, if you're into fitness, that's, that's what it'll be about. But aside from that, we're uh, like uh, the powerlifting thing, that's where it ties in with the whole video thing or vlogging thing. So the channel that I was planning on uh, starting up was gonna be a combination of like my, I guess, journey um, to see how I progress uh, through powerlifting and like how much I can get my strength up size wise all that stuff because I want to get huge like I want to get all kinds of huge like huge I, I could link you guys some huge guys look at just look at powerlifters see some crazy huge guys but that's the goal so um, I figured since I like doing it you guys seem to like doing stuff that I like doing. I thought I would bring you guys along. So I'm gonna do a couple of test videos on my on this site. And then if you guys really enjoy them, then I'll go ahead and actually create a channel specifically for that stuff. This gaming stuff as well, cause um, I don't know where, like where this video would go. So because I did a Goliath video yesterday, <laughs> I figured uh, I'll just post another Goliath video today. And you guys kind of get the idea of like, 
story time videos. Is that is that what we're, we're calling this shit? <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll come up with some kind of name for this series. If you guys can come up with a name, put it in the comments down below. Because uh, you guys know how amazing I am with my uh, clickbaity titles, right? I think, I think I've rambled on long enough. If you guys got any story time subject you guys would like me to talk about, anything that you guys would like to know, um, submit them down in the comment section below. <laughs> and um, stick around, guys, because we got all kinds of other videos but that's gonna do it for this video guys so if you guys did enjoy any part of this derpy ass video make sure you guys go down there smash that like button for me because it really does help out my channel and it gives me all kinds of motivation to keep making these videos for you guys and hey if you're new to my channel and uh you want to join along with this fun little um 4200 sub special week and uh catch all the cool new story time videos that we're doing or any of my other minecraft shit that i play uh, make sure you go down there and hit that subscribe button because uh that's how you get notified i post the next episode oh and guys um in case you didn't know here let's let, let's do this together shall we all right bam all right so when you guys go on my page right you guys basically get to see this screen if you go and you hit that subscribe button right you'll see a little chingadera right there click that and it's gonna say send me all notifications for this channel make sure you guys got that little thing checked off uh because if not you guys are gonna get notified uh, duh no i don't know when youtube did that but they kind of fuck shit up with that so um yeah i'm gonna go back to my cool theme <laughs> there we go it's some fucking chrome plugin that you can get for this but i think it looks amazing so uh yeah guys yeah that's gonna do it for this episode if you guys did enjoy any portion of it make sure you guys go down oh, i already did that outro didn't i all right uh, yeah 